Hi there, it's Shell and Clint. Hey everybody! Hope everyone's having a wonderful day today. Yeah, it's um, it's been a nice day. It feels a little bit warm right now, but probably because we've been up doing stuff. So, you want in here? so Clint just made his homemade noodles. We're gonna have turkey noodle soup. I have some turkey broth going in the Instapot pressure cooker thingamajiggy. <coughs> and I thought, well, we'll just kind of play. It's going to be a little while before we eat. And so I figured we'd just play. Sorry, I was drinking my water. And I have. <coughs> uh oh. You okay, Jess? You okay. <laughs> I have a bunch of these pieces from this glue book the one I was using and I thought you know we may as well use that and what I do is you know I have these bags I think I have them listed below if you're interested in them and they're about eight and a half by eleven a little bit bigger than, than that and I have these out here and as like I finish some things I put them together and as I um, like my scraps and stuff I kind of put them all in <coughs> one bag out here and then when my bag gets full I take it into the craft room but sometimes I don't put things you know in the craft room as quickly as I should what's up oh <laughs> Clint was like gone, baby. oh you look like you were doing something so like any pieces that I think you know that are kind of generic I put in here so we have like some envelopes I've chopped down uh, this one looks like I was going to make a pocket out of it. Um, oh, I forgot about this. A faux front flash card thing. That's fun. And then I thought we would just kind of go through this little bag and see what we could make. So, uh, I think we'll make some journaling cards first. Just because I have a few of those, and that's kind of what I was thinking about doing. Just kind of sit and have some fun. <laughs> Apart. <laughs> oh. So, yeah, that's what we're going to do. And then I'll have to pause it a few times, but, you know, I do that anyways because we do have uh, supper fixing to be going. And that takes a little bit. So, but yeah, you guys have seen these, I mean, so many times, like on Miss Gail's channel. I'm going to go ahead and trim this off. Let me find my other scissors. So, what did you guys do today? Are you staying busy? And are you doing, like, spring cleaning if you're home? Um, today, I wiped down cupboards. It's been a couple hours doing that and man I was so sore. <laughs> and then is that all I did today? I think that's all I did today. I am taking a little bit kind of doing some studying to kind of um, get more familiar with like doing dig digital kits and things mm -hmm. like that. Kind of teaching myself. I, I typically teach myself to do you know different things. Uh, that I want to learn, so I've been kind of putting it off, but I already had the course, so. And I sanded today. I sanded. Clint, yeah, he sanded a lot of um, ink blenders, so he he's a little bit behind on the ones that just paid, but they'll be going out in the next day or two. So. Yeah, these. Push. Sorry about that. Yeah, I think we'll have probably about three going out, three orders tomorrow because we have a. Uh, one person ordered two of them. Okay. Yeah. So, yeah. so we'll probably send three out tomorrow. And yeah. So yeah, that's what's been going on here. I'm trying to think. Surely I did something else. I thought I did something else, but I guess I didn't. Huh. I did um, put like the turkey bones and stuff in the oven earlier. What I do is, you know, when we have the carcass of the turkey bone or the turkey or whatever, I pop.
pop it in the oven for about an hour, like at 375. And I put some celery and some carrots and some onions, and it browns it up really nicely and adds a lot of flavor to it. So we both like that yeah. before I make it into broth. So it's kind of a long process, but I think it's definitely worth it. Okay, so we're just gonna collage, make some little journaling cards. So, but yeah, it's been a, a quiet day. We, I think Clint mentioned it in his, um, video he did oh yeah he did make the noodles we did he did a video for that helped him a little bit on that and uh that we do have work looks like on thursday we've had a couple of people call us and so we will be leaving the house on thursday which is fine you know still no cases here i keep waiting <laughs> Every day I'm like, have they got the test results back? Because the nurse I was watching, she said, it's definitely here. It's just when, you know, we'll find out it's here, I guess. So. I put an empty box on the table. Because they say, if you put an empty box on your craft table, the cats will lay in it. Yeah, so far no one's laying in it. Yeah, of course. <laughs> One time they don't lay in the dumb things. Totally empty box. And what's funny is Cubby's right beside it. <laughs> but he's not in it. <laughs> Told Clint, that would keep them, you know, from like trying to get right in in my face and stuff when they um, want to be on video and I know you guys love them so it's not that big of a deal but I think well maybe they'll start you know just laying there <laughs> not working but they'll discover it I think right I mean cats love boxes and I mean I just did it it's just funny that he's laying right beside it instead of in it oh he just discovered it look at him oh he's so excited so I'm kind of putting places on the inside that we can um, write on, you know, because I want these to be little journaling cards. He's just scoping out the box now. He's like, oh, I didn't see you there. Look at him, hon. I'm Sorry. <laughs> He's like, ooh, this is kind of nice. I kind of like it, I think. Oh, maybe not. We didn't see the bluebird again today. I was watching for him. Sometimes, you know, they'll stop by a few times. I'm using this really awesome Scotch Create. I really like this. It still has not dried out, and, you know, I just, I really like it. I'm really happy with it. Thank you, Miss Deborah. She's like, you got to try this. She loves it, too. And, and I, like I said, I still have tons of those um, Uhu sticks. They just, I think we're just so dry that they feel like they dry out and they get all gooky. But, yeah. Oops. Oh, well. One of the darker, but that's okay. And then... For some reason, the cats have started jumping on the counter. So I did that foil <laughs> to keep them off the counter. Supposed somebody said put foil down. And uh, so I did that. And we still haven't put up our outside cameras. So I still use them on the inside. And one of our guys jumped up there. And it wasn't any fun like the one I saw on Facebook. Because that would have been awesome. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, he just, he jumped up there and jumped down, I think. It didn't even really show what he was doing. It's kind of, kind of sad. But it was, you know, you know. So I do like just using like this whole, like a negative there. But I want some pretty paper. So I have just different 
papers, I thought, you know, may as well use them. She could make tags or something. I don't know. I don't want to use, like, really awesome paper, do I? No, no, no. What's this? It's kind of fun. I like that part, actually. Instead of the music. But, yeah, so Clint was busy cooking, and he's been busy all day. He did take a nap. And uh, I did get orders, you know, ready, and he ran them down to the post office, which, you know, isn't that far away. <laughs> if you're looking for these tear guides, I do have them listed as well down below. They're really fun. I just like to use them. I've had them for a long, long time. I don't use them all the time, but they're kind of nice. There's Sophia. She's looking for her daddy, I think. She's been um, crying at night again. But I've been just taking, putting tissue in my ear so she, <laughs> and going back to sleep. <laughs> I'm like, I need earplugs. I just put, put tissue in my ear, roll back over. and Well, and I mean, some nights she doesn't do that. And, you know, I just can't get up like at midnight every night because she's just sitting there crying. It's just yeah. a little bit little bit much because you know right after that she'll just start she'll um, do it again if I get up even a few minutes later she'll start start up again and it's just like I gotta get some sleep <laughs> I got to get some sleep this is kind of fun this was a um, I think it was from the button yeah yeah like the button um, Oh, yeah. yeah. So I'm just going to pop that on there. That's kind of fun. Yeah. It's a little bit thicker, but you know, that's the fun thing about collage. You can mix and match and stuff. So yeah, what have you guys been doing? Anything fun? Uh, one of my friends wrote, I can't remember, and she said, oh my gosh, I've been doing stuff all day and I haven't crafted yet. Oh, <laughs> and I was thinking, I haven't either. <laughs> I think it was Cindy. And yeah, so I was like, I gotta do some kind of craft today. I was gonna do it earlier, but I ended up just scrubbing things. And then I got so tired. My legs were hurting and stuff from standing. So I thought, you know. But then she said, but first, a nap. And I was thinking, yep, she's right. <laughs> Me too. Yeah. <laughs> so I went and took a nap. So hopefully she did too. <laughs> oh, you guys are so funny. You guys are so funny. But yeah, you know, when you get up at 3 o'clock every morning, it's just like, you don't have a choice. I no. fade, you know, if I don't take a nap. It's just like, I'm not going to make it until 7. <laughs> so yeah, that was... So I thought, well, she's taking a nap. I better go take one too. So I did. So I think what I'm going to do, this doesn't have, is it glued down very well. Well, see what I mean? That's the oohoo, and it just doesn't doesn't stay glued down. But I think what I'm going to do is go ahead and sew around it anyways. So I need a focal point on here. So let's see what we have. Um, I do have my box of goodies. What do I call this thing? Glory, Glory box. Yeah, that. 
just kind of, I don't know, just something fun. Maybe here's a, is that a sticker? No. A plastic piece. I don't know. You think that will stick? I guess we'll try it. Looks like it might. Hope I'm doing the right side. Yeah, I am. Oh, that's kind of fun. Hopefully that will stick down really nice. And then maybe like a butterfly? I don't know. I don't know. But I do have butterflies right here. I need a bright one. Bright, cheerful one. Okay, where's my... I'm trying to think. Because I think I have really big ones in my... DD book. They're in here. Let me grab it. So yeah, I've been just cleaning. I did clean the bathroom and I've been busy. I it's forgot I cleaned the bathroom, so that was nice. Straw that mama gave you that she wasn't supposed to. She is spoiling you rotten, old girl. She deserves to be spoiled. I gave Jazzy Lynn a new straw. She needed it. And she told Mama. She like is the... so precious when she wants one. She is. She follows me around and says, Mama, can I have a straw? And I'm like, sure can. Yeah. No problem there. I'll get you one. And then Clint's like, no, she doesn't need another straw. <laughs> but, you know, they're inexpensive and she loves them. So. Loves them. She looks at me and like, Mama, are you getting me a straw? Sure she, am. <laughs> she is such a sweet little thing. She's becoming so much more loving. She is. Uh, we snuggled on the couch earlier. Daddy, do you want to go let the steam oh, yeah. kind of out of the... <coughs> hey, Artie. That way we can start cooking our chicken noodle. It's already 5 o'clock. <laughs> We usually eat by five, but that's okay. It is what it is. No biggie. No biggie. Let's go ahead and put this down. Do I want anything else? So one of my plans, uh, Robin, is to, I need to write it down or I'll forget, is to go through my laces tomorrow and get those listed in the store but i will put a link or i'll do a video and show you guys but just kind of i have so much so many laces i need to get rid of some of them yes so i can buy more no yes 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 <laughs> oh I need man. something else on this page i just gotta figure out what I want. Oh, you need to tell me this. What is? Oh. <sighs> yeah, but you can tell them. Right now? If you want to, I don't care. Hey guys, we got wonderful news. Uh, Tina from Shabby Dabby Doodah. Uh, is it not Duda? Is it Shabby Dabby Duda? Yeah. Yeah. She asked us to be on her on her design team. Yeah, she asked us a while back, but we'll be putting up a design team every other video or every other month. Sorry. Every other month. So, so April's, April's our month. our month. At least every other month. We might even put up more than that. You never know. Yeah. You never know about us. But yeah, so Tina came to us and asked us. So uh, how, I'm so honored that. That was really fun. And yeah, so if you guys haven't checked out her um, digitals, they're kind of really fun. Fun ones, we'll be sharing those. And, you know, a bunch of other ladies are sharing them as well. And we actually have a special way of. I yeah, came up with a special Clint's gonna way come up. Yeah, Clint's going to. Kind of come up with a fun way uh, to use them this time. So. Yeah, I'm excited. I can't wait. So I forgot what I was looking at. So <laughs> oh, I was looking for flowers. I didn't find any. <laughs> I'm just look. I really like the yellow, but I need something like further up. I think. It's 
stuff. Baby bear, baby car. But yeah, um, but yeah, that's an honor. Oh, I see. Really, really sweet. Yeah. Hi, Tina. Hi, Tina. And I was watching her today, and she's talking about all the things she's doing with her kids, which is really cool. And she has an old, I think she said he was 19 or something, and she was going to discuss and have him look up like different types of mortgages and things like that. And I was thinking, you know, that is a good idea because, age, yeah, awesome. because, you know, my, yeah, my mom and dad never mentioned <laughs> anything like that. Yeah. So, you know, to learn something like that, that would have been really nice, you know, back yeah. in the day because. I think Clint's mom probably talked to him. Did she talk to you about stuff like that? I don't know. I don't know, Tracy. My mom never even owned really her own house, so. So, I don't know. I'm just kind of thinking about what I want here. Do I want that there? And then maybe just a fun little, yeah, I kind of like that don't really know what I'm what I'm thinking I'm just kind of putting things down and that's kind of that sticker thing is kind of acetate so we'll see how that how the glue and stuff holds up you know but I just like I love collaging I think it's so fun I like that just something simple and then maybe like a little butterfly on the inside I think that would be cute too and I still have these out but yeah we've just just been resting <laughs> which is what we always do anyway so it's not that big of a deal huh nope Yeah, this is what we do. I mean, this is the way our winters This is are. the way our winters are, so they're not, I mean, it's really nothing new for us. You know, I know a lot of people are kind of overwhelmed and stuff. And, uh, do I like that? Or do I want it over here? I think I want it over here. Our phone company, they, they are two months of service. Yeah, our phone company has sent us a notice that you know, don't don't worry about your payments or anything. If you, especially if you are, um, don't have work, you know. So that was nice. Some of the other places have done that, and then they said just um, contact us if you're having any issues. But the phone company just yeah, they just sent told. sent it to to everyone. I would imagine. Oh, I don't know, but yeah. So, things are working out, you know. Oh. It's still a scary, scary time, scary place, but, you know, we're all, like, everyone keeps saying we're all in this together. Yep, exactly. You know, it's just, it's not just you, and it's not just me, it's all of us, so. Yep. So, that is nice to know that we're all in this together. It smells so good in here. <laughs> Doesn't that smell good? Oh, yeah, I was just thinking, <laughs> man, that smells good. Yep, I think I want that underneath a little bit, just to... So what broth is in the freezer? Uh, we have ham broth in the yeah. freezer. So then, let's go ahead and... These are just really simple, they're a fun way, especially if you use a glue book, to just use your, um, you know, just to put in, use up your scraps and stuff, and then just pop them in a journal here and there as some scrapbook or journaling spot. That's really cute. I like that. And then, like I said, I think I'm going to go ahead and just sew around it. Right now, I have yellow in my machine. I won't do it on camera, but... They're kind of fun to have, like, a stash, because I did go through them really, really fast last time. I was kind of surprised, but... Two, I've been making so many journals, and I've been trying to really, like, stuff them full. And so, <laughs> I have t 
tons of, um, I don't have any room now, you know. This one, I think I'm going to cut it down. Let me see what it is. If it's eight and a half, I'm going to leave it. Uh, it's just a little bit too big. Who is that? Oh, sorry. I don't know. Is it? Oh, yeah. It's Gilligan. Gilligan. We have an Gilligan. outside cat that we call Gilligan. <laughs> I don't know why. Don't know why. So this one, yeah, it's not very sticky either, but we'll fix that. And then I'm gonna sew around this one as well, but I'll show you what I'm gonna do. You know, you could just cut this down and make a little tag, but you know what I'm gonna do is fold this in half. And then this will be like a page edge. That's kind of fun too. <laughs> just the edge of a page. So let's go ahead and just collage on it. Hi, Arctic. <clears throat> oh, I thought he was going to come see ya. He's such a sweetheart. He really is, isn't he? Yeah, he is. We're pretty happy with our cats. Have some new people. Hi guys, if you're new. Yes. And if you're old. Yeah. <laughs> we love you all. For all the new ones, welcome to our YouTube family. Yes, welcome to our family. But I did have a new one and she said that she has three kitties. Mm -hmm. And we love to see kitties. And we do share pictures um, of kitties and not just us, but our... Um, YouTube family and stuff share them over on our, our Facebook page, which is the Ramblin' Crafters with an S. This is a piece from Robin's, um, Robin's kit called, I have to think, no, Rachel's kit from Roxy Creations. So if I remember, I'll put a link below because such a cute piece. This was from her Easter kit. And it's just a piece I had left over, so may as well use it. Add some color. I haven't decided if I'm gonna, I'll probably cover him up because it's not, you know, my taste or whatever. But I think I'm just gonna do the outside because the inside's not really gonna matter. Yeah, it's a fun way to use up tons of scraps. And if you just make like a, a um, background, then you can always come back and put like your focal points, like the butterflies or whatever, later. But, you know, then they're ready to go when you're ready to go. This is really fragile paper, so it's really nice to use for this. It, um, I already for collaging, because like if you were to fold it, then it would just Aww. break on you and stuff. He just get part of this. Aw, that's sweet, isn't it? Uh, Those are my papers. I must have already, already used them. I'm going to start a new cover tomorrow. Clint said he is going to start a new cover tomorrow. Oh, you got to put in the store, aren't you? Yeah. Yeah. And I'm going to plan on... I don't know what I'm going to plan on. <laughs> I do have an idea with some of the fabric that Miss Lizette sent. And I want to use some of that, which I think will be really fun. Just kind of figuring out where I want pieces to go. I think I am going to cover him up, it's just because he's not something that I would, you know, typically use. And then here's my thing. What else do I have in here? That. Here's some children's paper. 
There she goes. So Sophia's up here now and she is looking. Oh, she's I don't want to that. She's in the box. She's out of the box. <laughs> that did not work so far, but she saw Daddy, I think is what she saw, didn't yeah. she? <laughs> Just fixing to lay down and then she saw Daddy and jumped out. <laughs> She loves them boxes. She does, too. When somebody said, I saw that somewhere. It was like on, um, I thought it was on like junk journal chat or something, where they said, you know, just if the cats are bothering you, just put a box on your table, and they'll sit in the box. She's back in the box. We'll see if she stays. And I thought, you nope. know, <laughs> she's out of the box. <laughs> and she's the one Whoever just, said that. <laughs> and she loves boxes. She's always laying in them. She's always, if there's a box, she is typically inside the box. <laughs> Maybe it needs something in it. I, don't I was know. thinking it might need like a, a, um, or something. Or a pillow of some sort or something. There we go. She's down. She's down for the that count. That is so cute. <laughs> she is such a big girl. It's like she can't decide. Do I want to sit in the box? Do I want to go see Daddy? See Mama? <laughs> That's funny. Okay, so let me go get soup on and I'll be right back. Okay, guys, so I got that taken care of. And it looks so good broth and stuff. Clint's in there chopping up the rest of the turkey so we can freeze it and put it in the soup. What have you guys made differently than what you would normally cook or whatever? We cook all the time so this is nothing new for us. <laughs> Just who we are but um, I was watching somebody they said what's for dinner and this one lady said she was going to attempt to make homemade biscuits which is something that we make like I said all the time and uh, it just kind of made me smile because you know she's trying something different oh it's her husband's birthday I think and uh, that's what he requested was homemade biscuits because they couldn't go out or anything and I thought you know that's kind of Kind of interesting, kind of sweet. So, I do like that. This is just a piece that I had left over from um, <coughs> from one of the projects we recently did. And I thought, you know, that's really pretty. I really like that. It's kind of turned out like a little pink, pink bit here and there. Let's go ahead and fold this want a part two and we'll go ahead and use it but yeah and then my brother you know he's like we never cook well you're gonna have to <laughs> that's what he's saying now i have to I still haven't found flour as far as i know <laughs> i want to break this up and kind of put it throughout but where he is but he did say they finally got to go grocery shopping so that was good yeah. Actually, I haven't written me today, so he's probably bake, baking away or something. Mm -hmm. But I was telling him, and I don't think I told you yet, that uh, one of the websites that I'm on, I don't, I don't know if anybody here is on it, but this one lady, she always asks us what's for dinner. And uh, this one lady said that her husband wants homemade biscuits. And so she was going to attempt to make biscuits, and I thought how cute that was. Yes. That that's what he wanted for his birthday was homemade biscuits, because that's something I make like all the time. I don't have a recipe or anything. Yeah, exactly. That's just you know that's just who we are. So, but I thought that was super sweet that that's what she was going to make for him for his birthday. Yeah, that's. But that's just what we do, because you guys know we're you know quite a ways from. Um, from town we're 25 miles from town and the nearest takeout so it's just you know we just 
don't take out. Look at that. It says rose right there. That's kind of fun. It's easier for, well, we just, we're not takeout people anyway. No. We, we never like have been. Cook. You know, some people <laughs> yeah. just don't like to cook. We like to cook. We like to cook. <laughs> and, you know, it's very often that I will make um, like a batch of pie crust and then just pop. I mean, that's just like, let's make a quiche or something for dinner. And that's what I do. And I often think, I wonder if anyone else out there is doing that. <laughs> making homemade pie crust for dinner because you know my sister would be like whatever <laughs> wouldn't she babe oh sis, sis she'd be like mm -mm. yeah <laughs> i'm not cooking <laughs> yeah, she sis good. is fast food she loves any fast food oh yeah she's yeah she's not much of a cook but that's kind of pretty but yeah it was just like you know, it just makes me smile to hear that all these people are out there just cooking and stuff now. Jazzy. It's kind of fun. It's kind of fun because that's something that we've always done. Yeah, we've done that. Matter of fact, when our wedding day, and I, after we got married, I went, we went drove up to City Market when we lived in town and got steaks. Yeah. And I could, that was the first time yeah, I cooked Yeah, that's steak. what we had for our, our uh, wedding dinner. <laughs> was steak yeah. homemade steak and we're just a we're homemade people I make homemade rolls and all the time not so much when I'm dieting because you know I don't need all that but <coughs> this is another piece from Rachel at Roxy Creations <coughs> so it's just a piece I had kind of left over but the colors are perfect so maybe just I don't know, I don't know where I want it well, in our first meal, I cooked for with my Mexican meatballs. Oh, that was so good. I have to do a video because I know somebody asked me. I think there were about the people that asked about that. Clint's Mexican meatloaf. But it's just things you think. Well, would anyone be interested? And you know, that's really good. Oh, sensation. <laughs> yeah, that. that's good. That would be pretty point friendly too, I oh, think, except for, I mean, except for the cream. cream. <laughs> except for the cream that's in it. But yeah, that would be pretty point friendly. Well, we haven't had that in a long time. No. <clears throat> kind of like this piece, but maybe I want this. You know, that's why I chose this butterfly trying to decide where I want it to go though. I don't know if I like the blue flowers. I do not know. This one, here's one, but it's kind of got blue. But I think I like that one better, this one better. <coughs> but again, you know, if you wanted to, you could just um, kind of stop right here and do your um, background and then come back later and decorate it once you had a project you know something for it to go into these feel pretty sticky so I'm not too concerned or maybe even right there because what it's going to be is like on a the back of a page or front and then yeah so really it doesn't shouldn't even go with the other side I'm just looking at it as a whole. I mean, I want it to, I guess, um, to correspond because, you know, it's going to be in the same journal or whatever. I want it to look nice together, but go ahead and do the edges while I'm thinking about it. But I don't have a specific journal or anything planned for this one. It was just kind of play in and see. Sometimes I'll throw these in like my... Um, orders or something or happy mail or whatever or Clint would be like let's send somebody some happy mail and yeah we'll, just, uh, we just pop some in the mail and you know I just throw in whatever I really if God if I feel like God's telling me to give then I do oh exactly you know I mean even locating you know I had one lady and, and she needed her power located and I just left after I got it done and 
never charged her. Never. No. Just something we've always done. So, <clears throat> or if it's on our heart, you know, just to just to give. Let's see. Oh. <clears throat> I'm thinking like maybe a stamp of some. Ooh, that's gonna be very <coughs> pretty. Oh, it's not okay. The broth smells so yummy, though. The only thing is, we don't put any salt in our broth, and I was <coughs> telling Claire we're gonna have to add some salt to the. <laughs> yeah. Because there's no no salt in the broth, none on the turkey, and there's salt in the noodles. very little in the noodles. So yeah, we have to. <coughs> when we cook at home, we just don't seem to put as much salt, and I have pills that kind of take down my salt, so I have to make sure that I get in a salt. Makes my salt low. That's cute. I like that. And then like a saying or something. Probably not going to get near as much done as I was anticipating. <laughs> what do you mean today? Yeah. Uh, yeah, just the, like using up some of the crap on your table. Yeah, that <laughs> crap in my bags. So let's see what I have. That really turned out cute. I really like that. I don't want black, maybe. Oh, sorry. The impulse was off down the entrance. Yeah. I did a little bit too much today, even though I don't feel like I did that much. But did a bunch of standing and stuff, cleaning. Say that standing gets hard. It does, and yeah, I feel it. <laughs> I feel it right now. <laughs> it's really hard for me to stand, and then standing is I think one of the worst things for me. Oh yeah. I get to hurt so bad. So this says the impossible is often the untried. It is, huh? Because uh, what are they? What's the other one? There's a will, there's a way. Yeah. Love using these. Uh, Tim Holtz words. I do have these listed below as or in the details as well. So I just kind of play with them until I'm happy with, you know, how it looks. I really like that. And I could go ahead and sew around it if I wanted to. And then I'm going to look over here and see what I want, which I do want a butterfly. I just feel like I need a butterfly on this one. But which one, huh? Are you no, laughing? I was just reading a comment from Maryland. Oh. From Maryland? Comedy hour. <laughs> Clint Show's comedy hour. Uh, or is it just Clint? No, it's just a book of this, but yeah. Because I was telling, I was telling some stories about my sister. Yeah, this on that was one. a while back. Oh. <laughs> on that one, because she was so, oh, you guys, my sister's in it, but I don't know where she got it from. <coughs> mm-hmm. <laughs> I like that. Kind of has the colors. I was just thinking that what Mr. Rogers would say is always look for the helpers. Yeah. You know, his mother, wasn't it his mother who said? Yeah, his mother, it was his mom. That his mom that. said, you know, there's always bad things that will happen, but there's always, you're always going to find helpers. So always look for the helpers. Sorry, I was just having to read a comment and it made me think about it. Yep, that's really, really, really insightful, I think. I think it is. I mean, uh, yeah. Kind of like that. This is one that has a little bit more pink. Oh, here's one. 
Yeah, I like that. I like that. And then I could put a little thing there. So kind of, I guess what I did is I just, you know, treated this like it was two different pieces, which is fine, you know, you have to do whatever you want to do, and I think it worked really nicely on this one. Ooh, I like that. And let's see what else we can put on this one. That's cute. Um... Let's do start each day with a grateful heart. I just like that. You guys seen the heart movement where everyone, um, I think it started in North Dakota. Um, it's been on the news and stuff is what they were saying. But I'm a member of it. It's like a prayer group. And they just started it like two or three days ago. And um, the, oh, the prayer group. Have you seen that? Anyways, they started it in, like, North Dakota, and so they're hanging up hearts and sharing hearts and stuff that they see around the world. Huh? Are you asking me if I've seen it? Yeah, a prayer group. But they just started it, and there's, like, over 50 or 60,000. What do they have? Uh, on it's on Facebook, yeah. Then I am, no, I haven't seen it. Somebody invited me to it, but it was, like, when the virus started and all that, the fear and stuff, and so everyone is, you know, praying together and um, covering their, I think it was, it started in North Dakota, <coughs> North Dakota, because it was, um, um, a lot of people are saying, oh, this was in North Dakota, and this was in North Dakota, so I think that's where it started, but they're all putting hearts and stuff on their windows, and like covering the windows with hearts, and just to tell people, hey, we're there for you and stuff, which is oh, really that's nice. Yeah, yeah that's it's a really good. neat little thing. So. Well, you know, here they're putting up lights and stuff, Christmas lights. Yeah, Christmas lights and stuff. <clears throat> so that's kind of fun. Do we have time for one more? I just know that they're new thing. You got time. Right? I know. I was just wondering about like time. Oh, coming. they're fine. Honey. You guys don't mind an extra time, long video. They need, to... they need us to keep talking. Yep. <laughs> Ramble on. Ramble on, huh? I have had some people say ramble on. They haven't said that exactly, but you know. You guys know. But yeah, they've enjoyed the the talking. Okay. Well, let's well, decorate guys, this one. You mean so much to us. I just know that. You guys really truly do mean so much to us. Yep. You really do. And these ones are No. I keep meaning to go through my closet and stuff because my clothes are getting so big and baggy that I'm going to have to buy new clothes as you soon as we can go shopping. Uh -huh. <laughs> so that's kind of fun. You really going to call me my uh -huh. Jazzy Lance helping Daddy. She's so cute. She is pretty cute, isn't she? She is just a ball. She's a sweetheart, for sure. This would be kind of fun to make this one pink, kind of pink too, huh? Oh, cool. Clint is taking care of laundry now. Oh, uh, pretty soon it's going to be short weather. Not you too know much what that longer. It's going to have the cops called on me because I look like a bum. <laughs> Clint start. he never would wear shorts and he started re wearing shorts to work recently. And I get too hot. And, and then we have cops called on him all the time. Because <laughs> he I looks like I, a bum. Oh, yeah. He I really does, Civil War do. shirts. And, <laughs> yeah, I kind of look like a bum. So here I'm getting into... Well, yeah. Like, fiber boxes, and yeah. And Split. then the cops pull up, and they're like, Hey, why are you in that box? And Clint's like, hmm. <laughs> Somebody saw you beating on something. Yeah. <laughs> oh, God. 
What I don't get is, you wear, here I am painting the ground. Well, to be fair, that one one time you weren't. Oh, the, and you yeah, were, the box. You were trying to open the box, and he couldn't get it open, so he had on his scroungy shorts and a shirt, and he's hitting the, <laughs> the metal lid. To break it loose. To break it loose, and so they called him, called because he looked like a bum trying to break into the... Yeah, that was funny. So, to be fair, that's that really was, what... Yeah. A lot of times, though, they were just bad. Yeah, that. That's all right. I don't mind. Else there. It, it's really funny, and the cops are like, oh, we knew it wasn't anything to worry yeah. about. But, you know, it could have been, especially in this, this day and age. Yeah, just I have not. gotten to where if I am going to be next to a school or something, I'll let the... Let them know that, hey... Hey, I'm over here locating, just so you know. Yeah, because better safe than sorry. Yeah. <laughs> And then I want this, like here, I think that'll be fun. Actually, I want to go ahead and just do a little bit of, a little bit of that. Again. Okay, let's do the other side. Lily telling you that it's treat time. They've been, they've been really um, telling me, oh, it's treat time. I give them treats, and then like an hour later, they'll be like, it's treat time. I said, I already know, and I already gave you treats. So, there. Try, treat. Trying to get a, yeah, double treat. No yeah, I'll give it to them in a minute, but it is treat time, I know. Actually, it's about past treat time, like almost an hour. <laughs> <laughs> but I've been giving it to them early treats and well, then they're when we go to bed they're like you forgot our treats and I'm like hmm did I so sometimes I have to ask Clint honey did I give them their treats because I don't remember I got so much going on <laughs> yeah you gave them I remember okay So on the outsides, I don't mind having like some um, print and stuff because, you know, that's the outside. But like on the inside, I just want to use coffee dye paper or um, something like that just uh, so people can write on them, you know, journal on it. larger piece than I need, but I don't mind having more coffee diet than the other one, or music than the other. And then on the inside, I'll just use some coffee dyed paper, because I have tons of that over here. So it's nice to do these once in a while, to kind of use up tons of your scraps, if you have, you know, tons of coffee dyed paper like I do, just scraps, scrappy pieces. Uh oh, Sophia's on the move. I'm getting hungry, but it is late, later than what we typically eat. I know it. But when Clint makes, you know, the homemade noodles and stuff, it um, takes a while. So, and then I had forgotten about the broth. So, I had to get up early for my nap and go pop that in the oven. <laughs> then I woke him up.
which is probably a good thing that I woke him up when I did, or else we probably would have had something else for yeah. dinner. Yeah. Because we wouldn't have. <laughs> well, what? When did I finish the noodles? It took you over oh, an hour, five. and it was after four. Yeah, I think it was after four when you were done with the video. something. I'm going to go ahead and glue that on. I'll probably have to trim around it, but that's okay. We've got Sophia. Hi, Sophia. Brushed. Brushed her a little bit the other day. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Let's see if we can just, you know, finish this off and then we'll call it good. What? Let's see if we have any. What? Ooh, that's pretty. Maybe something like this. They have kitty cats on it. I don't know. I don't know. Best wishes. Nothing that I really found. See if I have like what do I have of Roxy's? The Rapid Journal is still in the store. Oh yeah, the Bunny Journal still available if you're interested. And then, like we said, we will have other ones coming soon. As soon as I start working on them. <laughs> yeah. Well, the one I'm gonna do tomorrow is Peace. So that one's gonna take me a couple days. To oh yeah. I kind of like this. Just going to trim it out. Again, this is from um, Rachel at Roxy Creations. Just a piece I had left over from my last um, project. I'm not going to stress too much about how, you know, it's cut. Just kind of get most of the white off. But I really like the um, the bright pink or dark red or whatever. I think that'll be really pretty. Yeah. Who is it, Sophia? Mm -hmm. Aww. She has good kisses on her on your nose. She's a sweetheart, yeah. She's pretty cute. Marilyn, she's pretty cute. Marilyn told me to stop scaring her. <laughs> it ain't no fun if I don't. He's got to scare her. But man, she was jumping pretty good there for a little oh bit. Oh my gosh, took me over that Yeah, she, even she wasn't a scaredy one, and then, yeah. Lily Mae has never really been one that you could scare. No, she's not. not no. Once in a while, I can kind of scare her, but she's not. Yeah. I told them the story of Pard. Oh, yeah, several times. But you'll have to tell them again later, but not today. No, not today. <laughs> that one was but, Yeah, I'm trying to finish up here. Okay. Yeah, that was really funny. I kind of like that. I think I'm going to go with that. 
um, my mother-in-law was telling Clint, how come she does all these layers and then she covers everything up? <laughs> she said it always looks pretty when she's done, but <laughs> yeah, exactly. it just is, you know, that's just the process. It is, uh, I mean, that's what you're aiming for is to just do, you know, a bunch of the layers and covering them up. I mean, that's just what the whole thing thing is about and you know if you look at it not everything has covered you know I have this piece here it's you can see a bit of it you can even see a bit of the little um, coffee dye paper here the music paper so I try not to like put down a layer that I don't show a little bit of and I've had other people ask me that too <laughs> once in a while you'll have somebody who say why did you cover everything up I think it's people who are new to collaging Probably. But, you know, I mean, that's the whole point, is you want a focal point, too. It just kind of pulls it all together. Like, oh, I did have this piece. Just thinking about putting up here. So, yeah, we probably do that anyways. Just a piece I had, and I thought, oh, that'd be pretty. I, I, I don't think I got purple digitals, but I have purple paper. Well, yeah. But yeah, I mean, I did recently buy purple paper. Oh, uh, I couldn't remember if we downloaded any. Purple. I don't think I did, no. Must have been painters. I cannot remember, truthfully. I remember green. Hmm. So. I've done a green journal yet. Yeah. That'd be kind of neat. Well, maybe. Be in spring, you know, green grass, green tree. Hmm. So, let's see, how do we want this one? Ooh, maybe I like this. I love this right here. It says I love, so it's gonna, but, I don't know. I don't know. Okay, I'm going here. I don't know why. But then that one says I love right there, and let's finish it with Tim Holtz words. As soon as I find my Tim Holtz words here, they are. I love, I don't know, it just, I saw that and I just thought that was kind of, let's do this one, it says I feel so lucky, kind of there, and then maybe another one, like in between, um, Never give up. So it says, never give up, I love, and I feel so lucky. I don't know, I just thought that that was kind of fun. Uh, I still feel like I need another one, though. And be brave. Let's do be brave. Probably because it's like the black isn't a um, set of three. I don't know. It just feels like it's missing something. Maybe like a small flower or something over there. But like I said, you know, we can always come back later and do um, never give up. I feel so lucky. Be brave. I like that. What do you guys think? So we got, what, three done? So we got that one, this one, which I may come back and put words on. I haven't decided. And then this, which was really fun. I really like that one, too. Kind of pink. Oh, that's pretty. I like that. Yeah, I like the edge of a page or mm -hmm. something. That's so really thank pretty. you guys for hanging out with me. Uh, be sure and hit that subscribe button. We are putting up one or two videos a day right now. Uh, give this video a thumbs up. It really helps out our channel. And we will see you guys in the next video. Love you guys. See you soon. Bye. Bye, guys. Take care.